She was yeah, she's eating cock. <laughs> And that's what we're starting with. Hey, everybody, welcome to the Canaculture Podcast, the most consistently inconsistent podcast on the internet. Jay's not here, but it is me, Deacon, Tony, Plank, and Selena this week. Hispanic Heritage Month, everybody. How's it going? Woo! No, we did not plan this. We did not plan this at all. I think we got the podcast out of the way before I hit record. (laughs) We, we, We sat here for a good half an hour talking about dumb shit. From uh, China, break, our brick, the power of brick. brick, power of the power brick, of the brick NFT. So we we jumping into the brick NFT first, then, huh? Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, you brought it, it up, right? It's the thing that's in my head, honestly. It is the thing. All right, well, I can't me, get it like out I, of my head. at this point, if I don't buy a brick, can I say I really made it? Not really. So, no. <laughs> so I brought honestly. up before the podcast. I brought up that we should get into NFTs, and uh, Plank and Tony didn't really know what NFTs were. So I told them, open sea, just bricks. People b- buy and sell NFTs of pictures of bricks for obscene prices. Yes, you're reading that correctly. This price is going for $2,200 for a picture of a brick. <laughs> that one's not that bad, actually. It's not. It's, it's like a hollow. It looks brick. like a brick. It does. Yeah. <laughs> it looks advertised. I've seen this brick in real life, yes. have. It's a cinder block. This isn't a brick. It's a cinder block. In my driveway right now. <laughs> Take a picture of it. You might be a millionaire by tomorrow. <laughs> it's crazy though, bro. Like at the end of the for, day, <laughs> for our viewers that are only listening, it's a literal picture of a pixelated brick. Yes, thank pixel. It's art. red, orangey, pink, and know. it's selling for probably an obscene amount of money. Uh, twenty-two hundred dollars. Yep. For a picture of a fucking brick. Yep. 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 That NFT market got to be crazy, though. If pictures of brick are going for like two and a half K plus, you know the brick got to be going crazy. Oh, yeah. I mean, if we go to like highest last sale, 15 Ethereum right here. Jesus. Whoa. That's $51,000. Dude, that brick. Oh, that's pretty cool trip. looking, though. It that's is. This cool. is a pretty. Like, if I had those that's old. Not all right, all right, all right, all right. That's all pretty right. cool. So, go... 50, 50 G's, though? I don't know okay. if it's that cool. Right. First off, somebody go grab your old red and blue 3D glasses and tell me if it works. Because it looks like it might work. That might make the price. But, like. 50 G's, though? Yeah. That's like life changing money right there. That is. Literally. That's, some peop- that's higher than some people's yearly salary. Exactly. I don't think I've ever had 50 G's like in my accumulative com- accumulative life. I, I don't. Yeah, I don't think I've made 50 grand over the course of 27 Fake numbers. years. Well, I know I haven't. So, <laughs> what do you mean? You moving bricks? What you mean? Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, we can't so, talk about the side. I business. apologize. Uh, just bricks. Just, just bricks. <laughs> just bricks. Yeah. Just, br- just bricks. It's crazy though, bro. Like, they're just people are people are making a living. Off of these fucking bricks. No, no, no. They're not making a living. They're legitimately they're making a the top one percent, dog. Oh wait, is this one a video? Yeah, this is a video of Jess Bricks. Three hundred and thirty three thousand dollars. What? All right, that's worth it. It's a video. Hundred and hundred Ethereum. That is not worth that's, it. What and it's fuck? ten seconds long. What do you mean? Oh, You're paying that's 30, my intro for a video right there. You're paying thirty three grand a second for this video. Can you imagine buying that and no. <laughs> just having it in front of your video and be like, yeah. Guys, that that thing cost me a lot of money, and I'm gonna have it up for ten seconds because that's how Fuck that's how that. much that's how much money I have. I'd have that. The on brick loop. isn't even animated; it's the nope, background. It's the background. <laughs> you look really, really hard. You can see the brick move. No, that's oh, just the background. Hold on, hold on. Hold on let's no, do it. No, I think that's look, you, just you getting look. hard. Oh, ha! I made you look loser. You bitch. <laughs> I was over here looking to see if this fucking brick. I know. Moves. I wanted to see me. <laughs> That's crazy. There's no way he looked at that brick. I did. <laughs> he I thought did it look was at the brick. Move. I did. So like, this one's upside down. Oh, look why? at that fancy one. This one sold for oh, just over a grand. Down. Yeah. It just flipped it over. <laughs> <laughs> this is the other brick, but just upside down. <laughs> I was gonna say, didn't we just see this brick? <laughs> this is the first brick, but it's upside down. Oh my god. Look at that fancy one. Wait. Which one? Uh, the the uh, I can't get fifth one. This top Bro. right, then. 
The one yeah. that has all this. Oh, extra it's part shit. of the wall. Why is this oh, one only a, a grand? This Look should this should be really the fifty thousand dollar brick. That's cool. Oh. You got like a to, stack of money to... in here. You got like one, two, three, four, five. Six. You got a bunch of bricks in here. Hold on, maybe I you should get buy more bricks, bricks there. Guys, yeah, if we combine, oh. if we combine our wallets, we can get it. Cannon Culture is going to invest into just bricks. <laughs> just bricks. What? That's crazy. How do you get into just bricks? Is what I want to know. I, I found I, it I through. Uh, I found it through J Slat. J Slat. Okay. Yeah. I love him. It's just like what the. F Tony this cannot comprehend. Hey, seven two Ethereum. Bro, fucking pictures of bricks, bro. Like I don't. Yeah, I can't. Hey, this is a white brick. We know about these. Bro, this that looks like a silver ingot from fucking Minecraft. No, I've Minecraft has more pix life. pixels. <laughs> Wow. Hold on, wait. We're not talking about the side business. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. I'm talking about the silver ingot. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Is that what we call them now? This is like, bro. This sold at two point five and then went to three point three and now it's at seventeen. It's like, my my whole thing is like, well, okay, like, why are people buying this? Oh, so they can resell it. For fucking what then? Like, For is, the the, is no one like? There's no one out there like, oh, I want to keep this because it's it's gonna be mine. This is just like keep reselling it until it goes. It gets to a stupid price. Yeah, I mean, if you hold on to I mean, it what? long enough, the the hype's gone, and then you just got what, what a picture hype? of a brick. This is the first time I've ever heard of this. Yeah, and look at these sales, bro. You make your I... own brick and sell it. You can make your own NFT, yeah. Yeah, you can. Most artists do it. Yeah. All right, guys, let's make our own brick. Sel Selena's gonna make the Canon Culture NFT. And we're it wouldn't sell even it. be that hard. It wouldn't. Selena, you got this. <clears throat> okay. I want to see the NFT next week and we'll put it on the we'll put it on a store and we'll sell it. Right. Low key, you should make a stick figure and then see how much that shit sells for. Because no, these guys on. obviously will pay for anything. Stick figure. Let's see. What Have you, you got. seen my stick figures? They're so right good. Here. What the oh. fuck oh is Oh my it? god. Okay. No. no, my stick figures are no. way go bad. No. <laughs> you gotta show it, man. You gotta show it. <laughs> that was so fucking horrendous, dog. I need to know the price of those sticks. Oh my god. Make an offer. No one's bought this. Oh, I understand why no one's made an offer. Sort by recently sold. Oh, y'all didn't see that. He was getting his dicks. Yeah, he <laughs> was. We all yeah, saw that. Why. We all yeah. saw it. What is this? Imaginary. People are selling lists of imaginary <laughs> girlfriends. <laughs> Her name is Sage. She has blonde. Oh, my God. She met you at a gym. Nice. That's lies. She That's likes a lie to right do there. rope courses. The moment, the moment they said she, you, she met you at the gym. A lot of gamers would be like, "So, uh, so this cool. ain't mine, then." Wait, hold on. How the? F there's no fucking way that there's been a thousand of these. There's no way. Of what? It, look at it. The the imaginary girlfriend list. Oh shit! Here's number it one. Sold, one of them sold for a hundred. No, this is they're asking for a hundred. Oh. It sold for 0 0.03 Ethereum four days ago. So you can Ethereum? just ask for an outlandish price and probably get it one day. Yeah. Who made this? Created by this guy. Please tell me he had. Oh, oh my god. This is, yo. Okay. This guy's a trapper. Four point <laughs> seven k. He's made four thousand NFTs. This this guy is either extremely bored or extremely stupid. Show me the highest thing sold. Extremely oh. successful. A hundred highest last sale. It did, did it sell for? Oh, no, yeah, point oh three. Yeah, it didn't sell for a hundred. Oh He's my asking god! It. Holy shit! I need to find my name. I'll buy it. No, you, please don't. Please. Do not. <laughs> you know how much point one point zero one Ethereum is? Uh, that's like. I'm rich. Two hundred okay. bucks. Yeah, two hundred. About two hundred. Someone, change. someone paid two hundred dollars for this. My we question can, is why. We can def. We can just take screenshots of our webcams and sell them for that much on this website. What are we doing? The podcast. Uh, we don't need sponsors. We need <laughs> NFTs. This is what we. This is it's the actually, future. Holy shit. 
This is such a revelation. We could be rich. We could be rich. <laughs> Tony opening up MS Paint right now. I did. <laughs> <laughs> because my face lit up. <laughs> now let's see it, Tony. What you doing? Show us the NFT you making. I'm not making shit. I I'm knew just, I bought I'm an iPad for a reason. Slate the I'm going to use my iPad Listen. to draw for us. I got it. Don't worry. Listen, bro. Holy my shit. girlfriend has a fucking tablet to draw on. I'm, I'm completely fucking with it. Let's go. Yo, how do you pay taxes on NFTs? What you mean, man? Tony, if we combine our ideas. Do you think they pay taxes? I don't want to combine ideas with you. You scare what me, What do Selena. you mean? You scare me. <laughs> Tony is definitely going to get scared. <laughs> <laughs> the legitimate I, I fear I fear for I fear heard. for what you have I fear for the ideas you have let's just say that <laughs> as you it'll should. start off it'll start off like chill and then you'll be like yeah then then I'll be like oh that that was really weird I don't uh, no I don't want to do none of that <laughs> so it's gonna go all right I'll put the chicken nuggets in his toes I know, right? Like, wait, 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 wait. Who's toes and what chicken nuggets? We're drawing a Run, I want Grimace oh, with chicken nuggets. I thought we his... were drawing a brick. <laughs> Are there feet pick NFTs? <laughs> wait, feet NFTs? Hey, wait, wait, wait. Pick NFTs. Oh, oh no. I don't There's... like that. I don't like I don't that. Like... <laughs> Recently sold. Hit me. Hey, that might be it. Someone what? bought this for 3.49. Someone bought this. That's doggy. Someone bought this for 7.7 7 grand. Holy shit. This is <laughs> this is amazing. This is, a whole new world of This is made in like one of those iPhone avatar makers. Like they didn't even draw this. This was made Oh my god, look at all the money he made from that. 3.49, 3 3.39, 3.28, 3 3.45, 3, 3.2. This, okay, like, this man made like 35 grand off of dog pictures. I can't, oh, I, bro. Fuck. I can't. Mario, I'm selling you on the market. <laughs> oh, wow. This was supposed to be a podcast. Now I just want to... I just... You know what? Maybe we should have a special where we all just make NFTs together and put it on like <laughs> oh Patreon God. or OnlyFans. An oh, and then we can oh have the God. video of our NFT contest. Sell that as an NFT. Yeah, that's actually fucking insane. <laughs> we cracked the code. We got this. We make a video about it and then get maximum profit by selling the video. We get more. Oh, we get um, <laughs> more interactions if we have the viewers vote. Exactly. Who's NFT is gonna sell, or which one should be sold? You know, Plank's idea is pretty good because then you could buy the actual NFT and the making of the NFT. Oh my god! I'm. S I have no oh, words. Shit. I have no words. We're gonna be rich, boys. Jake can't <laughs> leave us alone anymore. <laughs> He's gonna look at the recordings and like, no. He's gonna be it. like, nah. I toss. I toss. Like, I, I toss that episode. We're Nothing not doing came that. Out that week. <laughs> well, you heard it first here, folks. Cannon culture is getting into the NFT market. Yep. <sighs> We're trying, to, I, trying I, to bring out the iPad. Wait, can you even do a brick if someone's already doing a brick? They don't got IP on a brick. Oh. Who would have thought? You, how do you copyright bricks? <laughs> Who owns bricks? And just go driving up to everyone's house and like, give me your bricks. You know what? We won't do bricks. We'll do cinder blocks, or we'll do like mm. sandbags or something. Bro, how how is it that <clears throat> bricks is getting a lot of money, but like people that are doing actual art are like, yeah, yeah just just buy something, please. NFTs are anything. memes, bro. At this point, the more man. meme you get, the more it sells. We're not looking at the same dog that sold for 3.8 Ethereum with a metal lower jaw and a fucking cast on his front right foot. <laughs> and he's like, <laughs> he's, he's got, got a, a fucking, spotting. he's got a lay on. Come on. Oh my God. Yeah. Isn't that a Christmas one? I don't fucking yeah, know. I think that, yeah, it is. I think it's a <clears throat> wreath. And he has, ch bro, I, I just, <laughs> whoever, whoever this creator is, they're definitely a fucking 
Uh, he's a genius. He they're is. a zoomer, he's dog. He's definitely he's, a zoomer. He's before his time. This is, this is not millennial shit. This, this is a zoomer. This is, for sure. this is definitely a zoomer. Hey, man. He's making fucking bank off that shit. He's making too. zoomer he's money. He's making fucking money. I'm going to look more into of it makes I kind of want to be broke, knowing that I, I kind of want to do this time. now. <laughs> All right, let's, let's, now, I'm even... now I'm gonna start yelling at people. Why are you broke? <laughs> Why are you broke? <laughs> <laughs> you could be drawing pictures just, of bricks to get move money. Some bricks, come on. I we have stop to, being poor. <laughs> we have to get off this, or we're gonna stay here the rest of the podcast. <laughs> All right. Uh. uh <laughs> I'm okay with that. Bro. <clears throat> I just I'm a I'm at a loss for words. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Um I agree. I don't like the world we live in, and I quite frankly, I wanna I die. like it. I can get rich. Could be worse. Could be living in China. Because they only <laughs> let people play three hours of video games a week if you're under eighteen. Yeah. Wow, smooth <clears throat> transition, buddy. Thanks, man. Yeah. Listen, I don't want to live in China. Fuck that. <laughs> True. Sorry. The, the, wow, imagine. It imagine. is it is definitely weird um considering like how big gaming is in China. Yeah. Because it's not only just like consoles and PC, it's, it's a lot of it's phones, mobile. Phones, everything. Phones, a lot of shit. So it's like weird choice. It's specifically weird. the fact that uh China has asked uh Netties and all the other companies to like pull back. That's another thing. Um, yeah. So if you don't know, uh, listeners, um, China has in, implemented a rule where uh, if you're under 18, you cannot play games during school nights and you're limited to three hours a week, one hour on Friday, Saturday and Sunday. So. Oh, could it also be because of the uh, the, the low birth rate? Could that probably be? <laughs> I mean, maybe. As weird as that sounds. No, that's that's directly because of the whole uh, one child law they had. Oh, they have a one. Oh. I thought that was Japan. Yeah. What? I no, it's China. W- is it? Okay. I might just yeah, get it's China. Because it has very low birth rate. Got you. Yeah. I mean, like, even it says right here, the online gaming industry uh, in 2020, the global market generated approximately $21.1 billion in revenue, translating to a, a record 21.9% growth. Like 10% of it. Uh, was from what is it? Let's say it. which more than ten percent are Chinese children. Uh, one billion mm. gamers online. What is that? A hundred million? No. Yeah, dude. Like, yeah. what is it? Half the half the world lives in China alone. Do they? Yeah, it's uh, the population in Japan or in China is fucking massive. I had no idea. <clears throat> I always thought it was like um, I thought India was like the biggest place or something. Oh no, it's it's definitely China. <laughs> Shit. That's yeah. that's wild though. I can't. I couldn't. I can't comprehend being under eighteen and just being allowed three hours a week because it's a fucking law, you know. I. I mean, I can't imagine it either. And like, fuck, dude. Because it it must be even rougher for them. Because like, the age you can't even are. be on your phone. Yeah. Well, which wait. is really. Oh, I mean, what I mean is, like, play. Oh, yeah. yeah. Because, <clears throat> like, God, imagine going to school nowadays and, like, not being able to play games on your phone. I mean, you can still talk to people, but fuck that. Like, <laughs> Fuck talking to people. <laughs> yeah, fuck that. True. Like, it's the weirdest thing is that it's going to cut down on so much other areas in gaming. Yeah. Like, not a lot of people are going to be on... Because, you know, they're probably minors. Oof. I don't know. It's such a weird thing, especially coming from China. I didn't expect that coming yeah, from China. Yeah, because they almost seem like leaders in the gaming industry right now. Like, I wouldn't say leaders. They're they're up there. Yeah, unfortunately. I mean, obviously, uh, like, there's studios all over the world. But, like, the presence that Tencent and NetEase has across the gaming community it's bigger than a well, lot of people realize that's more because they started buying a lot of like shares from other companies yeah. that they have their toes into pretty much a bunch of shit <clears throat> think they got any NFTs it's just still funny that people are not worried about that because it's like they have their toes on a lot of shit i mean once everyone got oh, over yeah. the tiktok fucking thing they're like oh fuck, china's not that bad they gave us tiktok like, oh. Whoa. yeah i don't oh, know about that i don't know 
TikTok to me is still a, a scary place to be. It is definitely like. <clears throat> I think the internet in general is scary. Just, oh, just yeah. the way they're fucking selling your data and shit. Yeah, it never used to be like this when I was a kid, at least. I mean, it might have been, but I just didn't give a fuck. Well, because it... it's probably not as bad as it is now. With yeah, it wasn't as bad. Services just fucking selling your data to whoever. I mean, to be fair, to be fair, Deacon, it was very new, and yeah. uh, we didn't like, like it was such a new thing that no one could like even fathom like what we, we could do with it. True. Like, ask people like, twenty years ago how the internet is now, and they'd be like. That's fucking insane. That sounds like witchcraft. Mm. Well, I mean, I, a lot of people forget that it was developed for, like, military use. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so. I mean, at this point, the way I look at it is, like, I don't really care who has my data. A, no one wants to be me. I don't want to be me. No one's going to take my that identity. That is true. And two, Google knows when I fucking take a shit. Because I have a Google Home Mini in my in my bathroom. <clears throat> So they have more personal information than anybody else can get on me. Uh, A23, Deacon is constipated. That doesn't give uh, you paranoia? No. That, that level of uh -uh. just listening in your home that I've, doesn't make you feel weird? I signed off on it a long time ago. A long time ago, I, I, I realized we're going to get to the point where... Like, when people talk about, uh, like, the biggest thing about the vaccine people didn't want to get was like, oh, it's monitoring you, monitoring you. Bitch, I carry a camera they and a microphone <laughs> on my person at all times. I do not give a fuck. And your phone has a GPS. And so GPS. People matter. can track me down to the block I'm on. And I carry this yeah. willingly. So let Google listen what? to me beat off. Well, yeah, That's what's crazy? <laughs> what's, what's crazy is people don't understand how much freedom they gave up. The moment, like Facebook, mm -hmm. all these social medias became a thing. That's why I don't worry about it because it's like, I mean, like at the end of the day, we kind of sold our 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 freedom away, not freedom, but like our privacy. privacy. Yeah. And uh, a long time ago, I think there's I think there's an argument to be said if uh, like let's say a company s sells another company like information about you, I do think you at least cut from that yeah that's because you know shitty. it's your information so that mm. like there's argument be argument to be said about that but if you're like at like advocating like oh yeah i want more privacy and all this shit it's like dude you live in the 20 21st century it's yeah. not gonna happen there's no privacy. like yeah. unless you go live in the fucking woods with no electricity there's no point Even like legitimately then, no if point. you take your phone with you all that's for not yeah if you take your phone it's like the, the people person. can still track you yeah yeah like I get the privacy, but at the same time, it's just it. That's how it's gonna. It's it's gonna get worse too. It's gonna get to a point of like I don't know if a lot of you have seen Futurama, but it's gonna <laughs> get to a point where basically they could read our minds and be like, "Yeah, hey, this is what you wanted, right?" Yeah. It's gonna get to a point where I mean, bro, let's let's not act like marketing is not fucking yeah, evil like, as fuck. Like when people oh, yeah. talk about like <laughs> pri oh, privacy, this privacy that like. I don't want any cameras or microphones or anything. Do you remember what it was like 20 years ago without Amazon Prime? Do you oh. remember what that was like? I take my fucking privacy. Have my Google probably knows my blood type. I don't fucking know my blood type. As long as I can get that shit I ordered in one day, have it. I don't care. Actually, actually, Deegan, I remember having to fucking call people from fucking telephones yep. like actual telephones what fucks with me is i used to remember everyone's phone telephone. number i used to remember yeah. it all. i can't remember a fucking phone number to save my life now yeah i used like i always i always say this about like when i'm with friends and like when we get to a point where, like this children these days will never know god of having to call your girlfriend and hoping the dad doesn't pick up oh shit Bro, uh, hi, can I talk to? I him? tell you, that shit was scary. Like, hello, can I can I speak to Annabelle? Who's this? They they can I Uh, uh, Tony. Um, I'm from school. I'm trying to fuck her. I'm sorry, I mean, uh, I'm trying to like, talk to her. Like, trying to fornicate bro, with her. her. Nobody, sorry. nobody, nobody no can understand that shit now. You you hang up and you call back 15 minutes later and you hope hang she yeah, yeah. And the mom picks up. You're like, all right, cool. Uh, I can, the mom's I can, yeah, chill. Yeah, yeah, her mom likes me. The mom, the dad now. No, you don't. You do not fuck with the dad, bro. I was dating this Cuban chick oh. in high school. Her dad hated oh, no. me. Fucking hated me. I would never call See, the house. I, I was dating a chick and she was like, yeah, my, my dad doesn't like you, but he's a bum, so I don't care. I was like, oh, all right, well, I'm in then. <laughs> and I was like, okay. Sorry. 
God. I was like, yes, sir. All right. Yeah, so, hey, uh, kids nowadays, go look through a phone book. We used to, we used to have to memorize those oh, fucking God. Numbers. Oh, my God, the okay. phone book, bro. Yeah. Like, it's funny because there's so much shit about privacy loss, uh, how the future, how the future is like becoming a little too like, a little too crazy sometimes. Yeah. I actually fuck with it. Like, yeah, I think I a lot of the changes are super dope. Um, some are some are a little creepy, but I mean, at the same time, like, whatever. I, what the fuck am I going to do? Might exactly. as well enjoy the ride. Yeah. You know, I think I feel, like, bad for my little brother. Even though, like, all that old shit, you know what I mean? Like, all the <clears> old <throat> the old era of having a fucking CD player, Ooh. having a VCR. Being on World of having Warcraft and having big someone ass call CRT. the house and you got kicked off the even, internet. I, my little brother never will never get to experience that. He has to experience all this high tech shit. Soon mm. enough, they're gonna have fucking shit implanted into your eye socket. I can't wait insane. for that. I can't fucking wait for that, bro. I would love, I would love to not have have to have my phone anymore and just have that shit like holographic. When we get in front of me, biotechnology where it's all just Dang. implanted, bro. No cap. I was looking at like. Um, RFID Wait, chips. Think, wasn't this a Black Mirror episode? Yes, we talked about it. Okay. I, was, I was looking at um, RFID chips that you can get implanted in like your hand and all that, where you can just write whatever you want to it. I want that shit. I want to be able to get in a smart hand? lock. Yes, like right here in your hand. I want to be able to write, like get a smart lock for my front door, write the lock to my hand so I never have to worry about keys again. I want something like that. I mean, but that... Go go plank. I was gonna say, wouldn't that just we you wouldn't even at that point, right? Motherfuckers would just take your hand. Stop. Now I got your house. Who am I who out, am I pissing off that they're chopping my hands off? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me, me. <laughs> you? Okay. Yeah, it was it's me. Can I live? We, we didn't make a me... profit from our bricks, well, I'm taking your hands <laughs> now. <laughs> <laughs> so essentially, like that I, I agree with Plank there. Like when we get to like ghost in the shell type shit, that's when I start getting a little scared. Cause like at that point people could just hack your body and like you're dead. Or some shit some who crazy you, shit like who that. Who are you pissing off in this scenario? No, 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 me, that's fair. That's fair. Like me. Like, like no, regular, regular people, like oh yeah, whatever. But like, can you imagine people hacking to the point where like they can hack your memories and be like, all right, yeah, cool, I stole your fucking credit card information. Later. I mean, I'm like, already in debt, so go ahead. <laughs> like I, dude, I think about. I get what you're I, I think saying, about though. this. Like no, the thing is, like I think about like ghosts and tell, ghosts in the shell type situations a lot because like I've told like I've told like everyone I know about this, but like. I would love to be alive during that time. Yeah. So that way I can put my fucking my meat brain into like a computer. So that way I never die because dying legitimately fu fucking frightens me. And I want to be immortal. I don't really? care. What, I don't care what. Oh, fuck it. Yeah, I don't care what pompous shit. You know, you would see your family die. I, I, you know, you would never be able to love someone. It's OK. I don't love it. He said I don't care. He said I don't even love me. I think Bro, like. <clears throat> it's so stupid to me. You know, you wouldn't like being immortal. Have you been immortal? No, shut the fuck up then. You don't know my life. That scares me more than dying is <clears throat> not dying. Nah. Bro. I agree. I I would love to get to the point where like the the doctor's like, yeah, you 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 have failing. like your AI is basically you. You don't you didn't die. You can do whatever you want. I'd be like, cool. And then I'd start fucking exploring shit. See, that's that's weird because you be said mind your AI is you. but you, That's the thing. Like, But your physical body that, died. Bro, is it really you? I know. I know. That's the thing. That's the, that's the crazy part. It's like, all right, this AI is specifically you. It's like, yeah, but how would that be me if I die? It would just be my AI. That wouldn't be me. I want to be. It's like the. It's not like, die. It's that's like the that, whole point. It's like that episode of the of Invincible where like he makes the clone of him, and they're like, you know, you know, you don't know which one's the clone. That way, no one can be superior. And it's like, am I really me if it's AI? Mm. You know, that's the thing. No, no, like the you are you because of you. And if you make a clone or like an AI, it's like that's not me because I am the original. But then it's like, well, what if I'm the clone? Then it gets to fucking weird shit like that. And I'm like, I just just put me in what, a fucking robot brain, bro. What's the genetic makeup of a soul, really? <laughs> exactly. Like, that's the thing. Like, 
Bro, honestly, I can't wait until we clone a first human just to see like if it comes out fucking stupid or not. Mm. I mean, we've cloned sheep before, right? Uh, yeah, sheep don't have. have souls. What? Ask a vegetarian <laughs> or PETA <laughs> real quick. Listen, man. They don't have souls. It's fine. All right. Later once on. we once we clone a human, teach it how to talk, if it survives that long, then we'll be like, all right, cool. Like, that, I didn't you're even alive. If we you're make, here. If we make a you clone. You seem like a regular person. If we you, souls must not mean anything, or we can just take them from the ether and like be like cool, or person's just comes out like fucking mentally just not there. Bro, I think about this shit a lot more than I really should, honestly. I mean, I, I mean, we're not far off because I think what was it, Sweden or something like that? Was the, it was Sweden the first place to like get FDA approved genetic meat grown in the lab, like chicken meat? It's been grown mm -hmm. from without a chicken. It's just like used chicken cells. And it's been FDA approved. And I'm like, we're not I far off. I, I want to try it. I'd like. <laughs> that's like, that's the impossible burger. This is actual meat. Yeah. It's, it's so uh, weird to me. It, it, but is it like, honestly, I've, I've always thought this, like, I feel like we would be f much farther in t like technologically speaking, if like the higher uh, echelon of people didn't like trickle down shit from for us trickle down economy economics it works apparently hey, oh shit like at this point like i feel like we should we should have been way farther but they're like nah we'd like our money so gas is still gonna be a thing let's just uh, read coals is still gonna be a thing like all the all the shit that's not renewable we're gonna keep going until like the planet can't take it anymore and then we'll th think about doing other shit <laughs> I mean, that's. I think that's why a lot of people praise Elon so much. My bad. You know, go you for think it. think that it's taken so long to get here because, like, they're trying to find the most profitable way to market to the to consumer, like consumers. No, I think they've literally said. I think they've literally just been like, "Oh, we're just gonna milk the planet until however long we can, and then we'll fix it later, so that way we can get the maximum profit without having to do anything about it." And then when it's like we have no more coal, no more gas, we there's no more dinosaur juice. What the fuck do we do? Dinosaur, it's like um, we could we could look into fucking solar panels and all this shit. But even then, solar panels is not like the entry. It's of great the for the environment. Yeah. And be all. yeah. Well, I mean, depends. But it's not it's not something that companies can like sell you a lot of and or gouge you from like. You can't just be like, oh, no more power for this because the sun went out. No, the sun's still here. Like, what? No, they can definitely make power. their money still. They'll just like, oh, you know that uh, electric tax credit you were going to get? We're just going to take that because, you know, fuck you. Exactly. We own the solar mm. panels. I don't know, man. Wow. The future scares me sometimes. How do we get here from oh. China only letting kids play three hours of games a week? I don't that's, know. That's, this is what three hours of video games do to you. Now you start thinking about the world. <laughs> now you got to be productive. Bro, honestly, huh? <laughs> honestly, the whole game of Valheim is you're fucking in the afterlife. And I'm like, man, I, what would the afterlife really be like? That's all I think about. It really, it, it haunts me. It really does. God, I'm so glad there's uh, people like you guys that, you know, think. Someone smarter <laughs> is working on this. I promise you. Bro, I have, it, it sucks. I have not I'm been elected about the bricks. <laughs> I, I envy people who are like, I just want to die and actually mean it. I'm like, I, I'm, a, I'm too afraid. I've never even thought about if I'm scared of death or not. I'm just, you well, know. Think about it that right now. Nice. What, do you, what do you think? That must be so nice. What do you think happens? I, I uh, envy your life. <clears throat> Growing up Christian, it's literally. I just don't been... want to. I just don't want to be put in the ground. I'm thinking about all the bugs. You're gonna be dead. Mm. It doesn't matter. You're not gonna Word. feel it. Yeah, you'd be dead. At that point, you wouldn't be you anymore. That's disgusting. Yeah, you'd be an AI. I don't like the idea. I don't like the idea I'm of trying to go bugs out like being a around me. Low key. You put me on that Bro, boat. Put them like on a boat. And... <laughs> <laughs> you guys yes, heard some sorry. of the theories about the afterlife? Uh, no, no. It's so fucking terrifying. Like one of them's like, oh yeah, you were an AI. Oh, well, or not AI. Matrix I'm sorry. Theory? Like a, a you were in a simulation. In a simulation. I'm like, bro, fuck, that there's, would be crazy. There's a subreddit called Glitch in the Matrix where people post pictures of, like, proof we're in a simulation. Like, it's three people that are wearing the exact same outfit sitting next to each <laughs> other. And it's like, 
if there if we were in a simulation, this is the proof. Let me see if I can find it real quick. You guys talk so much I, yourself. I just I, why would we be in a simulation? Well, that's like my thing. It's like why would that like I just I, I don't I don't see a reason for for us to be in a simulation unless like the world got so fucked up that this is the only way to live now. I mean, but how uh, how is it would... even living? Technically yeah. speaking, then. Also, if the world got so fucked I mean... up, this is the only way we can live. Where are the servers? What's it called? Uh, I think, therefore, I am. So, like, technically, in a simulation, yeah, you are living because you are thinking. But, but mm. it's your it's your definition of real. Like, I want to go to the real world. And... Man, they messed people... up my AI because I can't think. Some people would some people would be like, actually, exactly like the Matrix, like. That one dude who was eating the steak, he's like, yeah, I, I know this is fake, but it still tastes good. Yeah, like, <laughs> like shit like this. <laughs> like, I was, I, like, when I saw that, I was like, I mean, he's not wrong, though. <laughs> shit like this is what they say, like, Glitch in the Matrix is. <clears throat> oh, my God, even the dudes. Yeah. They're wearing I mean, different or, shoes that can't be real. I mean, or, like, they all know each other. Why is the hairstyle the same? From the it color and everything. Funny. It might be twins. Yeah, I think, uh, I think there's I three. I, uh, twins are more than there's three. The there you go. The there you go. I figured it out. <laughs> the, the computer ran out of RAM. They just needed the same little bit to be over again. Just download more, idiot. I just no, no. If it's... we were in a simulation, I'd be one to. I want to be way cooler than this, man. I'm such a fucking loser. <laughs> <laughs> you can't choose, man. Sucks. That's the same. That's bro. Yeah. No, once you die, you unlock creative mode. Every... See, this is what I'm saying. I think they messed up some of our AIs because. Everybody Link says he's a loser. Uh-huh. I don't not, have we're not, in my we're not head. AIs. We're actual people with human brains, but we just but, don't. But they're ones it. and Tony zeros, thinks. though. They're not real. <laughs> they're real to me. <laughs> What's the matter? What you think? You're a one and a zero. Ah, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's crazy. Oh, I can't talk. I can't. I can't think. There's about another that. one where every person in the world is actually the is actually and what? they're. Every person in the world is actually the same person in different times, and they're reincarnating into each other to become a god, or something like that. Who's that? It's called the egg. Beal. It's called the egg. It's really cool. Um, actually, terrifying once you start actually thinking about it, because like it means this whole world only has one person in it. It means that all, like we're all the same person, which means that you were at one point, you are at one point like the most pieces of shit in the world, but you are also. Like, the, the best parts of the world so i'm bill Gates. it's cool Fuck. but that also means that you're not actually you i want to be the ones and zeros I'm instead me yeah you like that one more i want to huh? be in the matrix instead yeah, i want to meet the cool version of me. <clears throat> i mean that's not possible anybody better than you is a cool version. we're all the same person i'm lil nas x oh no <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> that album was amazing by the way did you listen to it? Yeah, it was good. Oh my I god, it was so fucking good. What's your favorite song, Plank? I live in Montero. Tales of uh, Dominica. Tales of Dominica is really good. Yeah, I, that and Am I, Am I Dreaming. Am I Dreaming is good. I've had um, Sun Goes Down on repeat for a while. Really? Yeah. I didn't like that song that much. That just gets me in my feels. I don't, I don't really like singles too much. Uh, yeah, well, dude. sometimes the singles are good, but Yo, for the most part, like as a... Up. As a part of the album, they're usually just like not my favorite. Cardi, uh, was it Cardi B or was it Doja Cat? Doja Cat went off on Scoop. Doja Cat, yeah. Yeah. I assume oh, you shit, two. Look, like everyone's bored. Uh, 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 titties, bricks. I, <laughs> I, titties, I bricks. bricks. <laughs> Yo, Selena, get on a titty brick. We need that as an NFT soon. He a didn't say your titty nipple. brick. No, don't not, no, no. You don't have to use no. <laughs> you look not yours. Any titty will do. You can use anyone for reference. You can use mine for reference if you want. I don't care. But... <laughs> there you oh, go. Man. You use mine. That mine has white hair in it. That's what I like white to see. hair? This one's going to yeah. go for at least I'm old. two. I'm old. I'm 30, bro. I'm old. Just I'm dying my nipple hair. hair. <laughs> I'm not dying my fucking nipple hair. Don't you dare ever say some shit like that to me <laughs> wow. again. Wait. I'm highly offended. Nipple dog. hair? You have a singular nipple. A singular hair. No, nipple it's, multi- hair. it's a lot. Okay. I have a lot of white hair in my chest. That's fine, bro. Look at this. 
Yeah, you look distinct. You look like uh, Frederick Douglass. I don't know. Douglass and Frederick That's Douglass. Fire. Yeah. I'm trying to paint my nipple hairs like not paint them, but like dye them. <laughs> paint them. No, that paint them. Fire. Pink. You gotta bleach them first, man. Well, actually, yes, that's sir. Me. Bro, that's gonna hurt like a oh bitch. My God. I'll be all right. Let's get an <laughs> NFT girl, of man. let's get an Plank, NFT Plank, of bitch. Plank's nipple hair. Plank, Plank is living his best simulated life. <laughs> of course, <laughs> the simulated meatloaf. Oh my God. <laughs> Yo, can we get some simulated bricks on the NFT market? Oh my god! <laughs> Actually, I want a brick that's that's a uh, simu. It looks like a simulated. Oreo, no. Meatloaf. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Don't tell me no. Yes. Is your name Oreo? <laughs> some girls call me that. Okay. Okay. On that note, sp- speaking of gaming getting restricted in China, <laughs> have we got in depth about speaking of China? <laughs> have we got in depth about the people from Twitch going to YouTube? Hey man! Oh look, it's the real Oreo. Tim, <laughs> the, the, Tim, the, Tim, the, Tim, the, Tim the Tap Man is already a millionaire, and they just made him even more, more of a millionaire. millionaire. Very cool. What about us small guys, huh? Oh, you know you never get a deal. Like the small guys <laughs> never get deals. You get a G Fuel deal, and you get told to shut the fuck up. <laughs> I don't like G Fuel. <laughs> Give me a gamer substitute. They don't even get their own flavor. Uh, oh, well, Bill, Misfits get, uh, did big enough. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Why are you just this. standing like that? You know what, Selena? You're it's, asking it's the important he questions. Is. He's like, you know. Yeah. Isn't that how fat he's a people father. stand? He's a father. I can't confirm that. It's how fat people like stand. stand yeah. like <laughs> Bro, like, he actually um, kind of looked like a penguin with his arms out like that. You see that? <laughs> it I just was... reminds me of like, the Gmod pose that you have before you get like a prop or something. Oh, oh the T pose? pose? <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. His oh. arms are not out that wide. They are. He definitely looked like more of a, a penguin. Look at him. He even got that the head, the bald head. So it just looked like that, that rounded out oh, shape. No. Uh, but yeah, so Dr. Lupa, Tim the Tap Man, they both. <laughs> yeah. I couldn't, I couldn't attack this man anymore. Are we really going to go in? Are we really doing this? I love Tim the Tap Man. I just think it's funny. This man looks like a pre-made character you took like in GTA Online. No. <laughs> uh, yeah, Club Penguin look a little different right here. People are leaving. <laughs> God damn it, Selena! <laughs> I know if I, I now know if Jay feels like every week. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine. Uh, but a lot of a lot oh, of people shit. are leaving Twitch now, man, for YouTube and uh, even Facebook. I mean, gaming to, too. to be fair, Twitch is like Twitch is dog shit. It is. It's so bad. Bro, they literally had the world in their fucking hand. And what did they do? They fucked it up. And that's what makes me laugh about it. Because it's like, bro, you guys were at one point really, really big. And you guys are still big. Some would argue you the guys, only gaming s- s- live streaming website the there was. Only for a while. streaming. Yeah, the only streaming service ever. What about Facebook and, gaming. They came and like I said, only service ever. And instead of like monopolizing on it and doing some cool shit, they're just like, yeah, good enough. We're gonna let rest on our laurels and just chill. Where are you guys gonna go? And not Mm. fix anything and basically make it worse over time for the updates. And it's like, what? Why? Which has a lot of problems. Yeah. Like, bro, like, there's so many problems. I'm not even talking about the quality shit. Fuck it, I don't care. That shit's gonna stay forever. But like I'm talking like the hate shit, um, oh, the hate raids, yeah. the hate raids, the fact that rule enforcement. Oh, the fact that they didn't do shit about uh, DMC shit at all. Just just delete your vods. Like at all, just delete oh, your yeah. vods, delete even though they stay in your server forever. Yeah. Like, bro, y'all didn't grow up in the '90s apparently, because no. I was death back. like. After when I became an adult, I became deathly afraid of the fucking music industry. They're terrifying. They will go after you. They have no fucks to give, like yeah. at all. After LimeWire, after uh, Rhapsody, after all that shit, I was like, uh, I'm good. Crazy. They're crazy. Bro, the so you industry, think they got what? some killers, bro? <laughs> they literally are killers. Yeah. Like them and Metallica. Who was it? I think it was Nick Merckx who was like. People were asking him, like, you should stop using music. I think maybe Nick Merckx. I don't know who it was. And he was like, it's cool. 
I got it figured out. It's like, you have it figured out. But they've taken out multiple fucking companies in yeah. the past. He puts a dollar but away you... for every song he plays. <laughs> Not even that. Because like the the music industry has gotten to a point where they have they have come up with uh, ways to actually monetize, or not. Uh, they've found ways to actually prove how much money you you're actually stealing from them from just putting a song out. They did that. How? Yeah, the music industry has done that. You can look it up. It's fucking terrifying. They've legitimately made up a system where it's like, all right, if you play this Kanye song, you're actually losing us like $2.5 million, some crazy shit like that. And it's like, wow. what the fuck? Because it technically is correct. Like, not the price wise. I don't know about that. But they are losing out on money because the song that someone could have bought on whatever the fuck they would buy it on. Instead, they're listening to on on that stream. Even though I think that's a weak argument, because like I'm not gonna listen to Kanye ever. I'm not a Kanye fan. Yeah. So if I hear that shit on a stream, it's not like yo, I'm happy I heard that because I was I I was never gonna buy it to begin with. So for me, that's weird. But I guess that makes sense. Unless you're just streaming music, then that's stupid. Like just just music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but. Yeah, that's why that's why Twitch is leaving, or that's why people are leaving Twitch. There's just no future anymore. Like, there's no the algorithm, such dog shit. There is no algorithm to like for discoverability. So, make three cents just, on Spotify if I get played seven times. So it's uh, just a bunch of people like, oh, a bunch of people like flipping the coin in this fucking doom of nothing. Like, oh yeah, like maybe I'll get 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 in one day, become a fucking popular streamer. It's like, no, dude. It is a the lot chances of you harder. becoming a popular streamer. You'd have to get hit by lightning like 14 times and then see a shark fly before you can do that. Like, the chances of that shit's ridiculous. Yeah. I think one of Twitch's biggest problems is, like, uh, when they had that adpocalypse. Ooh, yeah. They, uh, they had one? You guys remember? Yeah, they had one. It was, like, remember. it was fairly recently, too. Mm -hmm. It was, like, was it last summer? Oh. I think so. I think so. I think what you're talking about. Because they... They started doing uh, like ad enforcement. Uh, yeah, you had to have pre rolls and or either you either had to have pre rolls or you have to run ads during your stream. And you don't make dick off ads when you play. Yeah, you make stream. you make like what you make such a low percentage off of what actually Twitch gets. That's another reason like <clears throat> Twitch takes so much fucking money from their creators when YouTube is just like, what is it thirty five percent? I think they take. Um, for no affiliates, it's straight up fifty percent. Fifty percent, like ads, bro. I've YouTube. I've run. I think I don't know how many ads I have it on auto ad now. So I run one every half hour, and I've only made a dollar. Like of ten dollars. No, for what my ads? No, that's for his subs. That's, that's overall. Including his subs. My ads yeah. overall. Yeah, so my he ads. Made, uh, one out of ten. A dollar seventeen off of all the ads I run, like an ad every half hour. Wait, so I'm confused. So money off subs. Yeah. If you had, if you had more viewers, would that number yes. go higher? It would. That okay, that makes sense. But still, it's like, I stream for like with three, maybe four hours every time I stream. So that's that's eight ads, six to eight ads, every time. In the past thirty days, I've made a dollar seventeen off them. That's wild. That you know what's wild. funny? Uh, as of recently, I've seen a lot of streamers, like. They start ad dumping. Yep. So every time something goes down, their mods will do like a one of seven. Like I've got a lot of those recently, like a one of seven check, which I, I can't blame anybody for wanting to make more money. But it's just like, damn, when you really think about it, when it's you just gotta like, dump it like that, though. Yeah, it's just like, wow. I That's can't bl a you can't blame Twitch for the the amount of ads. But damn, just like, holy shit. Yeah. Well, how I don't know. You could, de you, you could definitely blame them for the amount of ads. Like, <laughs> they, I just don't understand how they don't know how to do this shit. Like, the thing is, it's been proven that, like, ads that roll out before the fucking video even comes up, people will click off yep. immediately. No one wants to see that shit. I click off. Everyone does it. Uh, so, immediately starting out, starting it in the stream is like just you're killing off channels just doing that by itself. Not only that, like YouTube does not do that at all.
I, there's no fucking. I do want to say YouTube's not completely in the clear because I was watching. I was oh, watching a fifteen. It's not either. I was watching a fifteen minute video. The mid roll ad, fifty nine minutes. Yeah. You can't skip it after five seconds. But who's gonna put on a fucking movie in the middle of a fifteen minute video? <laughs> I. The thing is, I I pre, I don't care about that because like you can skip it. At the end of the day, YouTube lets you skip it. Yeah. yeah. Um. Although there are some creators that don't let you skip it, like because you can actually choose whether or not you can Ooh. skip. You can have them skip it. Yeah. It's pretty fucking gross. That's scummy as fuck. But uh, yeah, you can actually in your monetization options you can have actually. Uh oh. Tony pulling out the Carfax. No, no, no. I, I, I know, I know, I know they have that because I always have to it off because i don't like that like yeah i don't let i don't want my viewers to do that because like a i don't even get enough viewers to fucking to do that so that, yeah, yeah yeah so but also like for me like i would hate to have a creator do that to me so i'm like ah, fuck it yeah but yeah. that's the biggest part like i didn't run ads for the longest time on twitch and then i realized like if you're not running ads on your own channel they're gonna run them without you regardless and you're not gonna see any money so now yeah, that's exactly. why I put it on the half hour mark. You've like, barely seen them any money now, but I mean, a I mean, dollar listen, is better not, than they're nothing. They're not getting my $1. seventeen. That's mine. Well, that's the thing, though. It's like they're getting more than just that your dollar. They're yeah. getting so much more. That's the thing. It's like, I that's, that's what irks me about it. Twitch is just like, oh, yeah, like, here's here's this thing we gave you. It's like, all right, cool. But we're going to take, like, a lot of it. It's like, are you going to help me with my streams? No. No. What if DMCA comes? Or, fuck yeah, you. I don't. I think no, there, you, there you don't know us. More like either creator programs or just more general advice the... for smaller streamers because it's so hard. So they don't even. I don't think they let you get into communities at a certain no, point, right? You don't. You don't get communities until, until you partner. hit a, a partner. Yeah, Ex that's so. You can't make partners so partners so far though. Yeah, exactly. Damn, it's, that's crazy. It's so weird because like they. They don't uh, let you get into communities. They don't let you make stream teams, which arguably would be one of the biggest ways for you oh, yeah. to, to mingle as a, like other smaller stream streamers. Teams. Stream teams are basically you can set up a page with a bunch of people where you can find every member of that stream team in one place. It's a multi-stream. Yeah. So like if we made a stream team with like Selena, Aries, and Jay, they yeah. can go to the team name and they'd see all of our streams on the left, letting them know what we're streaming. If oh, we we're have live. to be partners but first. We have to be part. You can join one, but you have to be a partner to make one, which honestly, that's a bigger tool for affiliates. People that are, you know, not well known to, to mingle with other smaller streamers. Why well, would that you... sounds like it would be useful. Why would Twitch do You're that? Right. Why would they do that? <laughs> It's yeah. it's just unfortunate. Like I feel like, for me, I feel like they just got so cocky about like being the number one stream uh, website, and now it's like you fucked it up. You you I you dropped the bag, bro. Because yeah. like now YouTube's getting in it, and YouTube's getting in it pretty hard. Mm -hmm. Like because YouTube is it's so much easier, but at the same time a little bit more annoying because you thumbnails and whatnot. Mm. But like. That's like a five minute thing, dude. Like people who are, oh, you gotta make thumbnails. It's literally it's a minute, bro. Take a bad. picture on your phone. It's not yeah. that bad. Uh, not <laughs> not only that, but it's so much more chill. Like I personally don't understand the Twitch community type thing, where like, like the the culture behind it. Because I have I've never I haven't been on Twitch that long, yeah. so I'm immediately like already alienated. So for me, I'm already kind of like in my head checked out. Like I don't want to just fucking. Like I'd rather be on YouTube, but it fucks my analytics up. So that's why I'm on Twitch. Yeah, gotcha. yeah, I see that. It's it's bad though, cause uh, I know Plank. You probably know this, Medi, the GTA role player. Yeah, Das Medi. Yes. Yeah, Das. He was a pretty. He's pretty fucking big on Twitch, and just like it yeah, seems like out of nowhere, he just moved to Facebook gaming. And like that's the place you went to. Like Facebook gaming is a better option for like obviously money. Actually, hit. Facebook is pretty popping. Yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say there's a you, you big show. Who is it? True Vanguard, one a Destiny YouTuber. He does he does YouTube game or uh, Facebook gaming. And I'm like that's fucking weird. Yeah. Like, I would never think people. About now that I think about it, like Facebook still has people in it. Yeah. So like, why wouldn't you? Yeah. Like it's such an untapped market. Well, probably not anymore. It used to be. Yeah, you know um, they yeah. Facebook, despite like not being recognized as like a quote unquote real like streaming platform, it has like it it took some big streamers. There was this one guy uh, from 
who who RP'd on the same server. Do you, yeah. think you might know him, Lord Kevin. Yeah. He used to get around 20k viewers on Twitch name. streams. Lord Fuck. Kevin. Uh, Kevin. Kevin. K e b u n. Yeah. Kevin. Yeah. It was like oh. a pun on his character. Basically. That still sounds like Kevin to me. Yeah, his name is Kevin. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Basically, he was super extra history. just to say Kevin. Tony, you're focusing on the wrong thing. I'm sorry, dude. This is such a <laughs> dumb name. My name is Lord Kevin. Lord oh, Kevin. like your name Kevin? No, no, Kevin. It's like, I hate you. I hate you immediately. <laughs> yeah, but basically, he was like, a Don't very talk big to me streamer. or my children. He was a, a big 20K streamer, and they took him too. They took a bunch of people. They took yeah. this guy's toast. Uh, True Vanguard, they took they've taken a lot of people. Despite yeah, dude, that. True Vanguard surprised the shit out of me. They got King Gathalion too. Another Did, oh, player. that's right. He was on Mixer. He I was forgot. on Mixer for a while, and then they he gave took him that L. Facebook he took that L. He took that check too. <laughs> dude, that shit was funny. He was talking about. It. He's like, we really tried to do something different with Mixer. I'm like, King Gathalion just still bro. getting paid very well because yeah. they I was gave like, him another contract. I was like, bro, just say you take that L. I, I mean, like, I. There's no hatred. Like I, yeah. I think the dude's too dope as fuck. It's just I find it funny. As no, no, much, no. There's not as much no. shit as Mixer got, bro. They did. They kind of forced. Other, tried. They forced I'm... other platforms to give us low latency because they were the only ones doing it at the time. Mm. I'm so sad, Mixer. Like I know people uh, memed about it, but bro, like competition's always good. competition. Yeah, competition competition's good. always such a good thing, especially for the for for us, yeah. the consumer, not for like. <sighs> fucking mad about it for, like i'm still mad about it for a while when mixer was around twitch was kind of making improvements and like they had to yeah they had because they had to and now they don't have to because like what are you gonna do go to youtube uh, fucking good nice try you know it's like go to youtube or facebook haha -ha. god Twi twitch is like the drunk stepdad that just like comes home gets a beer and says stay i'm going to my chair watching my show don't fucking talk to me they only give us yeah. attention when they want they only see us every other alternating weekend because of the divorce. <laughs> I mean, like, can you blame them though, dude? Like, they. <sighs> Daddy Bezos. At the end of the day, they're doing whatever the fuck they want. Yeah. I mean, at the end of the day, they're killing their, their platform. platform. Not like, not gonna like completely die, but like, yeah. it's kind it's of gonna like, be a shadow of its former self. It's kind of like Nintendo. Mm. Nintendo doesn't have to make new games. We're gonna eat up whatever oh, Nintendo yeah. fans are gonna eat up whatever the fuck they get. So when something exactly. when the new Twitch features come out, everyone's always like, "Oh yeah, uh, new Twitch features." Blah, blah blah blah. It's like, but it's not. The company which is bad. why I hate Nintendo fans. Ooh, Nintendo sucks. Nintendo, yeah. Don't tell that to Nintendo fans. They're gonna be like, "No, dude, money. actually, Nintendo's." Tony, I don't you know, know if you know, but they made this Twitch, and that's like ahead of its time. Oh my god. Huh? You gotta fix your sensitivity. You just keep cutting out of nowhere. Do it. Sometimes, yeah. You've been doing it for the last couple times. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, man. It's live, folks. This is how it goes. Uh, Discord on. sucks. That's why we gotta get the IRL shit. <laughs> IRL. IRL shit. Let's just yeah, do a... We gotta get a loose studio. We gotta, yeah, right. we gotta get a... No, it's Wait. it's software, bro. I don't know what's going on. Like your Discord oh, yeah. sensitivity. Oh. Uh, yeah. Hold on. So when are we gonna do the IRL hot tub uh, podcast stream? COVID's almost Never. over. We can kind of get this going now. I'm gonna have my mask on during that shit. Oh yeah. If there no. ever is a time for that, I'm, I'm gonna no. Have don't my go, shit don't on. get me wrong. It's gonna be five separate pools. Oh oh oh, that's actually a lot better. Yeah. But it'll that's be like true. five separate pools inside a bigger pool. Oh. <laughs> oh, we're gonna be sectioned off. That's yeah. Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, that seems really weird. No, not that segregation. We're gonna be sectioned off. <laughs> oh, that's oh, even yeah. worse. You know, you know when you go to the club and they're like, you can't get into this section. So okay. basically, we're gonna be the favelas of hot tubs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Jesus. Oh my God. <laughs> that's horrible. I think at that time, the hot tub streams won't even be cool anymore. Like, it won't even be a funny meme. It'll be like a year down the line or On some shit. Honestly, if I don't see that's why like, you got to stack onto the meme saying, "Oh yeah, we're part of this hot new trend, hot tub <laughs> podcast." Poolception. <laughs> but we have to do it exactly a year or two after the trend started. If I don't see Plank in a fucking like donut thing, just going like this, <laughs> then I don't she want mean? it. Plank out the water. Oh, I'm gonna be in a donut and a bra. And a bra. Hold on. <laughs> 
I don't want to show no white hairs. Uh, on my I don't, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, they're going to be pink at that point. He'll die yeah, by yeah, that. Oh, that's right. And then I'm going to I'm going to take the bra off, and then everyone's going to see. <laughs> Exposed. <laughs> exactly. We got. We um, have to. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. That's. Man, we Already got... two steps ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all got anything else you want to talk about? Because we're just about at an hour. Oh, uh. I'm Not just thinking really. about the hot tub stream now. Yeah, no cap. Can we... Okay. <laughs> hot tub NFT. How would you even do that? Would it be a picture of a hot tub? Yeah, it's, it's just... It's a brick, but it's it looks like a hot tub. <laughs> yeah, it's just a brick. <laughs> <laughs> we'll call it hot tub anything. We take everyday objects and turn them into hot tubs. Hot brick. Hot, hot brick. <laughs> hot hot brick, brick summer. Oh, wow. That's good. Hot brick. Yeah. Hot brick summer. Oh wow! I'm impressed with that one, bro. People, the people who are who are making the fucking uh, NFTs are probably like, "Those are good, man. Write that shit down. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing that shit today. It's gonna sell for like two million. Two million. Holy fuck! Oh, uh, we're just giving away ideas. This this one's never Bro, coming out. I'd fucking cut myself if that happened. <laughs> they took, a good they idea took and our we gave ideas it for free. They recorded our whole we podcast. Royal, we need royalties on that bitch. Yeah, the hot bro, tub I'd, I'd legit try to sue, but then find, re- remember it. They just got two million, dog. What the fuck am I gonna what sue? Am I gonna, they got a whole team of lawyer bro. I can't even afford a lawyer, bro. <laughs> fucking bro, out of out of spite, they probably would just fucking waste all the money in lawyer fees. <laughs> Like we don't have the two million anymore. We spend it on all the lawyers. <laughs> They'll keep us in litigation for two years, bro. <laughs> Oh man! Oh well, no! Well, if you guys enjoyed this oh, no. podcast, it was sponsored by us. <laughs> Links in the description. Go follow us. Yes, sir. Sponsored by the Hispanics of the world. Hey, happy Thank Hispanic, you, Hispanic Pride Month. Month. Man, who's happy half of the month? Happy first half of Hispanic Heritage Month. Because we can't have one month. We we, we need two 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 half months. Let's, let's go around the room. Let's go around the room. Let's go around the the podcast. Who was your favorite Hispanic in history? Just to close this off. Oh shit! Exactly. <laughs> what? We'll catch you next week. I was gonna say Cesar Chavez, dog. You didn't let me finish. Oh well, a plank fucking threw me. Mine would probably be Elvis Crespo. Elvis Crespo. Oh my god! Oh my god, bro. I thought he was making a joke about Elvis, <laughs> Elvis Presley. And I was like, <laughs> Selena, you're letting the team, you're letting the team down. Come on, Jesus. All right, and stop recording. Yeah.